Welcome to the another video of C++ programming course. In this video we will learn conditional or relation operators in C++. Conditional or relation operators are used to compare two values or variables. If we have two values and variables and uh, we have to check uh, which is greater or which is less in, we use conditional or relation operators. After the expression, it would return a value which is 1 or 0. 1 means true and 0 means false. We check two values and variables and after the operation, after the expression, it will return a value 1 or 0. 1 means true and 0 means false. Conditional or relation operators are also called comparison operators. It compares two values or variables and return 1 or 0. These are mostly used in conditional statements where we compare two values. It is mostly used in if statements where we, condition, we, where we compare two values and checks, check the expressions. Here is some conditional relation operators. Double equal equal to x equal equal y. Not equal, it's, uh, it's called not equal. It's greater than, less than greater than or equal to less than or equal to so let's uh, do them practically i have opened my compiler and uh, i have written the basic or basic structure of c and i am declaring two variables index equal to 100 and y equal to 50. so you can also declare two variables in one line by separating comma These operators are used in a conditional statements like if but we check in this in the C out. So this is expression x greater than y. Greater than is a conditional operator. It will its expression will check if x is greater than y. If it is y it will return true. So x is 100, y is 50, x greater than y, it means x is greater than y, so its value is 1, 1 means true. And if we do it like this, if x less than y, so its value will be 0, 0 means false, because 100 is not less than 50. And if we do like this double equal it will check uh, if the both values are equal and uh, it will give true and if uh, both values are not equal it will returns false so x is 100 and y is 50 these are not the same or not equal so it, it is returning 0 0 means false and if i do this 100 so its value will be 1 because x equal equal y and x is 100 y is 100 both are equal and same and uh, this is a uh, not equal not equal it will check uh, if uh, x is not equal y it is returning 0 because x is uh, equal to why because this x is 100 and y is also 100 these are equal and it's saying if x is not equal it will return to you if both are not equal if i do like this then it will return one because these are not same so it's returning one so if i do It is returning 0 because it is checking if x is less than y is less than or equal to if x equal to y it will return 0 if 
effects are less than y if we do this so it will return 1 because it is saying if x less than or equal it is two conditions less than or equal in this condition x equal to y so it's returning 1 and if i do like this sorry uh, 99 so 99 is less than 100 and that's why it's returning 1 and if i do 50 it's also returning 1 because 50 is less than 100 this is the way to write uh, greater than or equal to x greater than or equal to y these are not true because x is 50 so it, now it will return 1 because both are equal so that's all for today we will learn more of about uh, conditional correlation operators when we learn conditional statements.